What is up, guys? Annie here again. Yes, another re-upload for uh, Fairy Tale episode 310. Main reason why I specifically chose this one because there was a Warner Brothers film playing in the background of my TV. It was Madagascar 3, and I'm just saying, Madagascar 3 movie that is gonna be a huge copyright, most likely a strike. So the moment I saw that, I had to take that off right away. I needed to re-upload it again. So. Here we are again. Once again, majority of the day I'm going to be spending re-uploading old videos. So, yeah, don't don't be so like crazy. Be like, yo, how many videos these upload, bro? I'm just uploading old videos because there's shit going on with my channel that I gotta take care of. Uh, I'm gonna limit though how much I'm gonna be reviewing because once again, I'm going to be going through a lot, and I mean a lot. So to make things easier, I'm just going to you know upload or talk uh, not upload but talk I'm gonna keep talking to a minimal as much as I can because I want this to be a worthwhile video while at the same time I want to use my time more wisely you know what I mean so yeah uh, fairy tale 310 what can we say Larcade freaky magic orgasming magic very sexual magic Minerva apparently smashed and I'm really going on a limb and saying her and Rogue have smashed They are always together Rogue and Minerva are always and I mean always near each other So I'm gonna go on a limb and saying they <whistles> Yeah, but yeah it, overall um I will have to admit, Larcade magic is by far one of the most menacing magics I've seen. It's very inappropriate, but it's very menacing in a way because it takes certain instinctual factors that us as humans cannot resist, as in pleasure, pain. It's not something we can ignore and it's not something we can fight against so easily or at all. He takes certain, like, instinctual properties or, like, senses of a human being and pretty much puts it on blast to the point to where it murders us he plans to make a person I'm assuming orgasm so many times to the point to where they die and when someone goes through the feeling of pleasure no one is going to resist that unless my goodness you are abstinent as if you know what I mean so yeah his magic is very, how can I say this, absolute, which makes him, in a way, I can see very terrifying. It's silly, but I can see the seriousness in it. I know this is going out of reach of episode 310, but we've also seen him use stuff like uh, making people lose... Hold up, sorry guys, Like, there's like this knot here that's bugging me. Sorry. Can you like untangle and crap? Can you like stop? Hold up. There we go. Sorry about that, guys. So yeah, um, we've seen him use stuff to where he makes someone starve to death, to the someone so hungry to where their insides are basically a bottomless pit that needs to be filled. Puts them in a situation to where th when, they, when they sleep, they sleep and they'll never wake up, which is basically death. His power is so absolute, it's almost impossible to counter. I mean, Grey was able to counter him. If so, it, He uses the power. His power reacts to people that have already had. And it, he also forces people that are pretty much virgins to like feel that sensation as if they were they have already <laughs> so yeah there's that and I must say very terrifying for me the sleeping one is by far the scariest I like though that sting counters most of it thanks to his, thanks to his dragon slayer trait he eats Larkade spells and his putting Lark putting a sting to sleep counters it by going into the shadow heightening every one of his other senses not gonna lie very resourceful very resourceful 
Lark, it's not that Larkade wasn't a bad opponent. It's just that he met his match. I don't know how you can face that. Freaking a light and dra a light shadow dragon slayer. Well, at excuse me. Well, at the same time, being able to counter most of anything while dipping into your shadow as coverage and uh, sense heighten heightening. It's hard to beat that Larkade. I don't know. When I saw Larkade, I thought he would be like Acnologia level when Zeref was so like praising him will be like, oh, Acnologia's here? Larkade's got this. Bro, Larkade is strong, but I don't think he's anywhere near Acnologia's level. Acnologia has beaten enemies without even flinching. He's beaten enemies without even trying. He just shows up and they're done. That's what happened with uh, the Elemental Dragon Slayer. Damn, what was his name? Siren? Siri? Siren? Siren? Something like that. The one with the stupid pigtails. So yeah, um, him. So he was... The fact that he took, that, took out an Elemental Dragon Slayer just like that without even trying is nasty. Larkade's gonna take him down? Please. He ain't gonna do shit. I don't see that happening at all. The only the only one I see close enough to taking down Acnologia is Zeref. Zeref's the only one I see that's a match for him. Or is close to... Or not maybe not close, but is the only one I see other than... Acnologia himself of fighting him of fighting him. So yeah, I don't see anyone else. Well, maybe Irene. Irene. Yeah, maybe Irene. Irene is a possibility. I do maybe see her. So yeah, that's a very much so a possibility. Cause she is freaking powerful, bro. Freaking Queen of Dragons. I can't wait to see episode 313 of Fairy Tale, man. I need to find out more of that story. I'm just busy doing these re-uploads just so like um, how can I say this? Just so I can avoid any copyright issue. Because once again, this channel is my last chance. I don't want to blow it. So yeah, um, I'm pretty much going to call it quits for this. Like, I'm done with it. Because I need to look over other stuff. So yeah. If there's anything you want to talk about relating to um, this particular episode or fairy tale as a whole... Uh, feel free to let me know in the comment section below. I'll be more than happy to see your suggestions. As long as you're polite and not a douche about it. Alright? That's the only condition I ask. If you happen to see other videos, guys, that look like they could be target for copyright that you've seen before, make sure to let me know in the comment section below. Or, if you are on my Discord, message me directly on Discord and we'll talk about it amongst each other. That way I can be like, okay, I can take care of this, no problem. <clears throat> but yeah, that's pretty much it. I'm going to keep looking around and see what I can do. But just know, before the end of the day, I will have Fairy Tale Episode 313 up. You best believe that. I'm just trying to get through as much as I can today before I upload it. You know what I mean? Alright then, guys. <clears throat> Once again, don't forget to like, comment, sub if you haven't already. Really motivates me to put more content out there for you guys, and I'll see you guys all in my future reactions. For those of you that are still left confused, I am doing this to avoid copyright strikes. Once again, I am going through my channel and pretty much purging anything that could be copyright. That basically could be copyright issue. That way, I can avoid it, my channel's safe, and I don't have to worry about anything. As well as deleting the previous videos that could be claimed. So, yeah, that way I can still keep my videos and I lose no content for you guys to see. But you're going to have to go through old vid You're going to have to go through the re-uploaded videos for those that haven't seen it yet. Or for those newcomers. So, yeah. For newcomers, if you don't know what's going on, yeah, that's what's essentially happening right now. Um, but from now, from here onwards, this television will no longer be turned on. That way, I will not be having issues anymore. Oh, by the way, I'm also known as Any Tier. You can call me by Guild Forever. You see it right here. So you can call me either Guild Forever or Any Tier, whatever you prefer. 
I'm fine with either one. Any tier is just basically me, my, my, my code name. That's my code name. This is the channel name. I. All right then, guys. I'll see you guys all in whatever I re-upload next, or in the next fairy tale video. Peace. Ah.